Details this noon after a mass shooting outside a restaurant in Miami Gardens. Police say multiple people were injured. We're live on air and always streaming on CBS News Miami with the CBS News app. Good afternoon. I'm Nicole Lauren. This noon, we're learning that the shooting happened while filming a popular rapper's music video. CBS 4's Jacqueline Quinn has been digging for details all morning long. She joins us now with what we know so far. So, Jacqueline, what can you tell us? Well, you know, I just got an update here, and it says that uh, of the 10 people, the four people who were taken to the hospital are actually in critical condition. But yes, 10 people recovering from the, their injuries at this time right now. And Miami Dade Fire and Rescue told us earlier that when they got to this scene here, people uh, that were hurt were all over this area. Uh, as a result, six were taken to nearby hospitals, and four people went privately. Again, we just got that update that four people are, are in critical condition, and we're going to go ahead and share with you some new witness video of the scene uh, that happened just right after the shooting. The Miami Gardens Police Department tells us here that the shooting broke out following an altercation around 8 p.m. in this area of Northwest 177th and 27th Avenue. A witness here telling us that the shooting occurred during a video production for rapper French Montana. And another rapper who was here, he described us running away from the bullets. So we did what was logical. We took cover too. We ducked down to cover. Um, people started running. Um, some people was running by with blood on their shirt. Some people was crying on the ground asking for help. Um, it's, it's nothing you can do out there. You know, people, I just feel sad for them that they're on the floor crying. Now, investigators are looking into what happened. In fact, we saw two of them here still on the scene, and police tell us that they have not made any arrests in this case. Nicole, back to you in the studio. All right, Jacqueline, thank you for those updates. Now, we do know that someone came back to the scene this morning. I did see it was a woman. So what did she have to tell you? Uh, well, her name was Kayla Sanchez, and she was actually looking for her English bulldog, a white and tan uh, bull English bulldog. That was actually a part uh, of the video shoot out here, and she tells us, well, her boyfriend rented out a 1988 Caprice for the video production, and he had their dogs with him. During the shooting, one of the dogs ran away, uh, and they have not found their English bulldog. And you can see his car in the background from the file video or the scene video that we had. It was actually towed away so that police could try and recover evidence. Uh, that's actually the missing dog, the missing dog's mom to the little puppy that stayed behind. The dog that ran away answers to the name Chola. The shots happened. My dog got scared and she ran away. Uh, from what we understand, she jumped in somebody's car and when they got to 22nd Avenue, she jumped out of now, she told us she drove up to a very hectic scene. She saw people running away, uh, but right now at this time, she is driving around the neighborhood looking for a dog. She says that they are offering a small, a small reward. So if anyone can help with that, you know, to please contact this Kayla Sanchez because she is missing her dog. For now, reporting in Miami Gardens, I'm Jacqueline Quinn, CBS4 News.